a former Langkawi wanita AMNO member Anina Saaduddin is currently facing two legal suits. Datuk Seri Najib Tun Razak's application to strike out Anina's suit against him over the 2.6 billion donation issue will now be the verdict by November 18, and the hearing by both AMNO leaders to strike out her suit over the termination of membership is on November 30th. Our application to stay this at closure 11 pending the outcome of the striking out application in the termination suit against the court. That one is coming up on the 30th November. So Yaarif was informed why we, what is the relationship of that suit or that issue to this issue uh, pertaining to the striking out and we informed the court that if that particular application of striking out there fails, then this application will have to fail as well. But if the application there even succeeds, not necessarily this application fails. You follow? <coughs> so rather than hearing everything here now, might as well we hear that case on the 30th of November, that's right now. Because if that is in our favour, this doesn't have to take the court's time. The court can use the time for some other cases. High Court Judicial Commissioner Muhammad Zaki Abdul Wahab wants to deliberate over the stay application after hearing submissions by the parties in chambers. Because of the two different course of action, there is no uh, reason to stay the striking of application in this suit. Secondly, we are saying that the plaintiff rather acted uh, in uh, uh, rather the, the plaintiff has delayed in filing the stay application. And do not come in clean uh, and do not come to court with clean hands because the plaintiff only waited after we got the stay on the first of October to file this stay. When the plaintiff should have actually filed immediately after we put in an application to stay all further proceedings pending our striking up. On August 28th, Anina filed a suit against Najib to account for the money allegedly given to him by a Middle Eastern donor to help ruling Coalition Barisan National retain power in the 2013 general election. She filed another suit over her termination on September 11, claiming that her dismissal from the party was not valid under the AMNO constitution.